Good evening, everybody. Surfing Daddy Pops is back. Uh, we have today is the Plastic Empire 2020 New York City Comic Con virtual mystery box, virtual con mystery box. Um, has no bearing on any of the pops that had come out that particular day from Funko. They just tied it into a mystery box on the same day, I believe. Um, my buddy had let me know that there was a mystery box for 50 and and $100, and I think we both tried for the 50 um, It said guaranteed value of 50 bucks. Um, for the $50 box and uh, up to 500 uh, you could get anywhere from one to two pops I think the hundred dollar one might have been two to four pops. I had to look but I didn't go after that one anyway, so it doesn't matter um, this was basically Just the one or two pops $50 $50 guaranteed value and When I came in today, it's just in one small box uh, No damage or anything like that. So it's good to go uh, I don't even know what to expect. I don't even know if I know the pop exists when I open it up. I don't even know what it's gonna be. There's no theme or nothing. So we're just gonna get right to it. Sydney was playing um, Fortnite in front of me, so she might say hi real quick. What's up? Uh... All right, it's in disorder, so that's good. Do you know what we're gonna get? Or like, is there a chart? No, it's just, it was called New York City Comic Con Virtual Con. That's when Funko released their stuff. Mm -hmm online but they decided to do a mystery box as well oh, okay. so guaranteed value so it's not gonna be in a protector um, it's definitely not a Eeyore <laughs> but what we're gonna do uh, city will actually scan it oh you want to do it okay. Okay, we're not gonna see I'm not gonna look I'm not gonna look am I peeking oh what is that I don't know what is it I don't know. Let me see. I can't. oh 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 Hold on, is this an anime? Nope. <laughs> is it supposed to be like that? What? Yeah. Like how the dirt? Um, yeah, a little, little grubby. I don't know if that's supposed to be. Um, that's no, cool. it's not. But that means it was probably played with and put back. But check it out. Bam. Um, there's a bunch of fakes going around too. I think this one climbed up a bunch because uh. Uh, my buddy had gotten one for a friend, and he was climbing. I think he was in the 40 range. I think he's double that. 2015 pop. 70. Yeah, 70 bucks. I thought he was around the 80 range. Oh my I gosh. Been... So. The heck. I, I, that's. I'm okay. That's a good one. It's finally a decent hit. Yeah. Um, Sid did notice. It is a little. Um, Dirty on the face, but I'll have to ask and see. Paint back then is garbage sometimes, so the paint's a little wacky. But um, and there is a bunch of fakes. It was, 50, it was 2015. Too. Yep, 2015. So, we'll to check it out. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Box is great. Um, just hope it's not a fake. But I'll do the comparison and go from there. But other than that, I mean, it's a win-win. $50, it's worth about 70 Cool. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So Daddy Pops out, thanks. All right, guys, real quick. I was able to look up some content. Um, Sun and Pops was one of them who sells on Macari. They did a, they're doing a huge list of like hundreds of different pops of fake versus real. Um, they had some really good tu tutorial stuff. And then a gentleman on, um, after just Googling the title, No Box Damage. Um, newer, newer YouTuber but he pulled the same pop from the same company, Plastica Empire, um, back in July, I think the video was. Only has like 17 to 20 views, but it's no big deal. Great content though, because we were talking about the same thing. What happens if we get a, a, a fake one sold to us? But um, there was a lot of just weird stuff on this. Um, the first thing for us was, you know, thickness of here. Movies is a little different color over here. But the real one does have a nice fading of yellow to white versus the fake, which is like more yellow all the way through. Um, the fake is going to be more white faced than the green color. Um, this was concerning, obviously, but it is real. Also, there's some. The R right here, there's a rounded R right there. The fake one has a straight line R. Um, and then, other than that, even on the back side, I think was fine, no issues. The top, you know, everybody says that, you know, movies is a little bit bigger in font. Um, it all checks out, man. The colors are all good. 
it's just a scary looking box and it's something I haven't really seen um, even shared it to my buddy but man it's so blank on the bottom it's crazy but we're safe even the 10 over here is legit the other one the one is actually a different font than the zero on the fake but this is the same but those are the ones that uh, stand out pretty good I can take it out I know this says it's shiny on the buckle and some other you know random stuff but I don't have to get that far detail I feel a lot better already so good pull value right now it keeps increasing it's up to like 70 bucks so that's just the follow-up on the uh, mystery box hope you guys enjoyed surfing daddy's out thanks